In the celestial realm of Takamagara, where the gods and goddesses of Japanese mythology resided, there lived a formidable deity known as Bishamon, the god of warriors and soldiers. His name, meaning two-headed gatekeeper, hinted at his dual nature as both a protector and a fierce warrior. Bishamon's appearance was as imposing as his reputation. Clad in resplendent armor adorned with intricate designs, he carried a menacing halberd in one hand and a pagoda-shaped treasure tower in the other. His face was stern and unyielding, his eyes piercing like the gaze of an eagle. As the guardian of the northern gate of Takamagara, Bishamon stood watch over the realm, repelling any threats that dared to approach. His unwavering loyalty and unwavering resolve made him a formidable ally to the gods and a terror to their enemies. One fateful day, as Bishamon patrolled the celestial boundary, he encountered a group of malevolent spirits known as Oni. These creatures, with their grotesque forms and insatiable hunger for destruction, sought to breach the gates of Takamagara and wreak havoc upon the divine realm. Without hesitation, Bishamon charged into battle, his halberd flashing through the air like a bolt of lightning. The Oni, taken aback by his ferocity, fought back with equal savagery. The clash of steel against bone echoed through the heavens as the two sides engaged in a bloody conflict. Despite the Oni's overwhelming numbers, Bishamon's unwavering determination and divine power proved too much for them. With each swing of his halberd, he sent the creatures crashing to the ground, their bodies dissolving into nothingness. As the battle raged, Bishamon's pagoda-shaped treasure tower began to glow with an ethereal light. From within its depths, countless tiny warriors emerged, each armed with a miniature halberd. These celestial soldiers, known as the Hachimangu, joined the fray, bolstering Bishamon's forces and overwhelming the Oni. One by one, the Oni fell, their cries of anguish echoing through the celestial realm. Finally, with a mighty blow from his halberd, Bishamon shattered the last of the creatures, sending its remnants scattering into the void. Victorious, Bishamon returned to his post at the northern gate, his armor dented and his halberd stained with the blood of his enemies. The gods and goddesses of Takamagara hailed him as a hero, their gratitude boundless for his unwavering protection. From that day forward, Bishamon's reputation as the god of warriors and soldiers grew throughout the land. Warriors and soldiers alike prayed to him for strength, courage, and victory in battle. His image adorned temples and shrines, where people sought his protection and guidance. But Bishamon was not merely a god of war. He was also a compassionate deity who cared deeply for the well-being of his followers. He bestowed blessings upon those who sought his favor, granting them prosperity, health, and happiness. As the centuries passed, Bishamon's legend continued to be passed down through generations. He became a symbol of strength, resilience, and unwavering loyalty. And so, the god of warriors and soldiers remained an enduring figure in Japanese mythology, forever revered as the protector of the divine realm and the guardian of those who fought for justice and righteousness.